Hello and welcome to the number one brash, bold, cool, electrifying, awesome and great people's WWE channel. As always, go check out all my videos, my videos previous to this one. Share this video, tell your friends about Rip The Rock. Go and view and like the People's WWE page, Team Bring It, and WWN World Wrestling Network on Facebook. And add me on Facebook at Richard, at Richard J. J. Pate. <clears throat> Excuse me. Because I am your host. I am Rick The Rock. So... Follow me on Twitter at Rip the Rock Pit, hashtag Rip the Rock, hashtag WWE Smackdown Live. And leave your comment below, check out that description below, and please, please do me a big favour and click that bell so you get all my notifications. First of all, I do want to give another big, big shout out to Ringside Chat. Go and check them out on Facebook. Tell my said you if you want to, anybody else wants to check it out. All you have to do is like and subscribe. Because this is, we are on the road to the Royal Rumble. And this is your Smackdown Live and 205 Live review. So on Smackdown Live, it was the Ambrose Asylum. So good to see that back. And I think it might be the first ever on Smackdown. Not too sure. Dean Ambrose came out talking. He will be in the Royal Rumble match. His guest was a Miz. He came out talking. He will also be in the Royal Rumble match. Miz attacked Dean. And then Dean did the dirty did deeds on Miz. Obviously this just hyped up there. Rather than continue to hype it up. It was supposed to be Nikki Bella versus Natalia, but they brawled and had to be separated by referees. Um, I would presume that that's going to be a match at the Royal Rumble, possibly on the kickoff show. It was in a fresh match in singles action. Kalisto taking on Dolph Ziggler. Kalisto came up with a win here, so a big, big win for Kalisto. After the match, Dolph beat up Kalisto with a chair, and then Apollo Crews came out and Dolph beat him up. So it obviously continues Dolph's heel run. Um, your next match was for the WWE Smackdown Tag Team Titles. American Alpha beat Randy Orton and Bray Wyatt. And it's still your Smackdown Tag Team Champions. So, yeah, good one for these. American Alpha here. Uh, problems continue, still continuing in the Wyatt family between Orton and Luke Harper. Your next match... Sorry, no, sorry, excuse me. Next week on Smackdown Live, it will be Alexa Bliss... Becky Lynch, Becky Lynch for the SmackDown Women's Championship and the first ever women's steel cage match. So this is huge. I really think this should happen on a pay-per-view, but you're getting it on a SmackDown Live, so that's absolutely huge. Your next match in a fresh match, Carmella beat CJ Lund or Lunde. Uh, not really much we said here. The WWE Champion AJ Styles will be on ESPN on Sport as well on Sports Center on ESPN today and you may have it in a fresh match with AJ Styles on commentary John Cena beat Baron Corbin so great to see John Cena back in the ring and wrestling and this is his first match since his return since uh, October so yeah it was a decent Smackdown and I give it seven rock bottoms out of ten on 205 Live, Noam Dar beat Cedric Alexander. Um, so much, much needed win for Noam here. And I mean, wins as of late. And I suppose the thing going on with Alicia Fox certainly gives um, Noam a storyline. Your next match, in a fresh match, the Ryan Kendrick beat Sean Maluta. Not really much we said here. Jack Gallagher came out of talking, then Arya, Arya Davari did. Uh, and, they, and then uh, Aria beat up Jack and he has to be separated ref by referees. Uh, I suppose that's a decent storyline. And they are going to have the first ever I forfeit match. It's basically like an I quit match, but he says they say I forfeit. So a little bit different. 
and your main event, Cruiserweight Champion, Rich Swan beat Tony Nice. So, yeah, good that Rich Swan is continuing, continuing his winning streaks. Uh, and I give 205 Live 5 rock bottoms out of 10. I will be doing an NXT review. Get checking that out. I will be doing a PCW um, predictions. It'll be two two predictions in one video. That's if PCW put up some matches. I also will be doing PCW review. Two reviews for two shows, but one video. And I'll also be reviewing the WWE United Kingdom Championship Tournament. Probably be reviewing that on Sunday. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. As always, like and subscribe if you smell what The Rock is cooking.